Windows Steps Recorder. It's a built-in Windows application that allows you to record your keystrokes, capture screenshots, and annotate or to help in troubleshooting or even in giving directions. This is especially useful when you need to show a technician exactly what you did before something went wrong on your computer. To start Steps Recorder, simply click on the Start menu and begin by typing Steps. And here you see the Steps Recorder. It's a very small application that opens up in the screen. So if you click on the Help button on the far right hand side, you'll see the settings. There's not much to the settings in here. Enable screen capture, yes or no. How many screen captures to store and where by default you would like to save the file to. But you can ignore those settings. So let's begin. Click on Start Record. Now every single thing that you click on, you'll notice as I click, there's a little red circle that flashes, meaning that screenshot has just been taken. And if I click into here and say, for example, I want to show a technician that this command is not working. What I can do is at this point, I can add a comment and I can highlight a part of the screen. The comment I would like to add is the log off command does not work. Okay, once you click on OK, that stores that as part of this recording as well. And then whatever else you click on, all of these commands are going to be recorded. So once I stop recording, here's what happens. It creates this file. And if we just expand it here, you'll see step one, use the left double clicked on this PC. And where I added the comment, use a comment. The log off command does not work. And this is the area that I selected. And you can see each recorded screen has a green highlight, meaning that's the particular box that you clicked on. So there's no way that you can go wrong, including right click or left click. Everything is recorded and at the very bottom is additional steps. Now you have the option to save the file and this is what you'd want to say, send to your technician. So you can just say, you can call the file whatever you want, basically. Log off does not work. So it saves this file. And in this case, we've put it into our downloads folder and it saves it as a zip file. The actual file is a recording.mht file. And all the technician has to do is double click on it. It will open it up in Internet Explorer. And you just basically view all the steps that happened in here. That way, there's no confusion in what you want to portray. You can also send a file like this to a family member if you're trying to explain to them step by step what to do.